What's good guys? Today we're checking out the Air Jordan 3 Retro Flip. This was part of a series that I wanted to do, you know, three times the charm with Jordan Retros. Uh, I traded, I, I didn't trade, I, I went to get a pair of the Mocha 3s and I sent my PayPal money and the guy tried to scam me. Uh, he never shipped them so it's really only going to be two Retros but nevertheless I'm kind of dubbing over this part of the video. I can't remember what I was saying. Um, so if it seems awkward in the sense, I just want to preface this video by saying I'm not getting the mochas. Let's get into it. Now these have just been sitting in a box since 2007. Retro card is in here. Uh, I put a the other retro card for the Fire Red 3s I put in here as well. And I also put a uh, dryer sheet in here. The shoes are dead stock, but the bo box is a little musty. Shoes are perfectly fine, but I just want to get that smell out. Bang, bang. Just, you know, I have never really gotten a chance to hold these in person. When they were released in 2007, I wasn't really into kicks, but I remember reading about these, and I just was fascinated by the flip print. Um, you can see that it has the cement print all over the upper, just canvassing the shoe. And just speaking to that quality, we have beautiful silver eyelets for the laces and a flashy silver jump man on a white tongue beautiful you got the metallic air and the black jump man on the back heel tab here again clean colorways but what really did it for me was the inside you see this beautiful plush black leather so comfortable it's like you know sitting inside of a luxury car talking about quality just like on the back uh, black flips you see you have a varsity red jump man inside there you have it the white flips gorgeous gorgeous shoe one thing from my size 12 homies I actually only wanted the fire reds this is not a shoe I want in my collection so if anyone has some trades that they'd like to offer for these, please let me know down in the comments. I'm looking for home and away number Jordans from 1 to 13, preferably dead sock condition. So if you have any of those, please contact me. That's why I'm not going to be doing an on feet for these, just because I wouldn't want to, you know, flex the pair on YouTube and then turn around and sell them to you, pretending like, you know, they still weren't dead sock. So gorgeous shoe. I hope you guys enjoyed. We're going to leave out with some music, reminding you guys to like and favorite as always. Peace. Mm -hmm.